Welcome back to TV Talk tonight. Our first guest is an up and coming actress. You may have seen her as Reese's girlfriend in Malcolm in the Middle or as the Tanner Exit Girl in ER, but you're going to get to know her this summer as Victoria Fairchild on NBC's new uh, mini series, Persons Unknown. Please welcome Kate Lang Johnson. Hey, Kate. Hi. Thanks for coming in. Oh, it's no been problem. very well. <laughs> so tell us about Persons Unknown, your new show. Um, Persons Unknown is an awesome show coming out June 7th on NBC. Um, and it's about a group of seven strangers that are drugged and kidnapped. And then they wake up in this town in the middle of nowhere. Uh, and they can't escape uh, for various reasons that will be explained. <laughs> and uh, there's cameras watching them. They don't know why. They don't know what's going on. And then... Mm. Uh, whoever this mysterious force is, they start playing, you know, psychological, emotional, and even some, like, physical, you know, games that really have some physical damage on so them. So it's sort too. of like Sore meets Big Brother? Meets Lost, meets kind of. Kind yeah, of thing. that's that kind of thing. Yeah, it's... and your character, why is she brought to this house? Is, uh, well, tell well us that about, I'm about... sure will be well, revealed. Well, will be revealed, but... But she's the, uh, my character is, I play kind of the rich, snotty girl, um... She nothing is, like real life. Yeah, yeah nothing, nothing. No, it was, it was really a stretch. Um, <laughs> but she's the daughter of uh, the U.S. ambassador to Rome, and so she gets kidnapped from Rome, and she's a party mm -hmm. girl. And when she wakes up there, she doesn't even... She's so used to waking up in random hotels in the middle of nowhere that she's like, whoa. <laughs> you know, she doesn't even quite... It takes her a second, you know, for okay. me to hang over to. She's, she's that girl. To figure out what's going on. Yeah. And Alan Ruck is in the show and a lot of other yes, people like Alan that. Yes, Alan Ruck. That was so fun because Ferris Bueller's Day. Well, one of my favorite movies. We love Cameron from Ferris Bueller. I know. He's yeah. amazing. And he's just one of the nicest actors in the world. Um, in fact, the whole cast, that was, was mm. so cool. Like, we all moved to Mexico City and shot it and... It was like Melrose Place. We all lived in the same apartment complex and we all became friends and they're just the nicest people ever. So oh, fantastic. I really lucked out in that regard. That was really good. And uh, you've uh, you've been on CSI Miami. Yes. And, and you've actually been on twice. The first time you played yeah. Hot Young Babe. <laughs> that was one of my first jobs. <laughs> I just played a girl that, like a co-star that didn't want to give over her cell phone because... Uh, but they obviously liked you and brought you back many years later and you actually played a real character. Yeah, it was Haley. a completely, yeah. yeah, like four or five years later and it was, yeah. uh, it was a much bigger role. I guess star playing Cheryl Ladd's uh, daughter. Oh, so you got and to work I, with Cheryl Ladd. Yes, oh, yes. again, you know, again, the, like... Alright, so when, when they're making the child these Angels TV movie remake. Yes, you know, right? We can cast yeah, right here, like obviously. I could be your daughter. I think so, definitely. <laughs> but she's again a wonderful lady. And, and who did you play on ER? This is a funny character you oh, played on ER. Oh, ER. I, just, I played a tenor exic, a girl that uh, <laughs> tans too much and doesn't eat enough. So um, that was funny. That was like six hours in the makeup chair getting. What season super was that? That tan. must have been later in, in the uh, season oh, when I they're running out of plots. I don't remember. It by year it 12, just... it's like, what kind of new person can we bring to the yeah, hospital? We'll Someone who's some fallen asleep. Oh, tanning. So that was that was a little funny job. Oh, okay, and you're 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 a bit of a world traveler. You're, yes, I hear you almost had problems getting to the the set of uh, Persons Unknown. Yeah, so I love uh, my one of my favorite hobbies is traveling. So I go backpacking uh, for at least a month every year, just mm -hmm. through random places. And right before I booked Persons Unknown, and then I had six weeks off till I started shooting. So I went to India uh, to go backpacking. Very and nice. Traveled all around India. It was really fun. And then went up into Kashmir, which probably wasn't the smartest idea. And then uh, hiked into the Himalayas, uh, and the friend I was traveling with got super sick in the mountains, two days hike in, into the Himalayas, outside of Kashmir, which is hard to get to anyways, and I had five days to get down to Delhi so I could... I could fly out and I was like well I can't leave my friend and you had no cell phone and no, no cell way of talking to anyone no way of talking to anyone it was like we couldn't even get internet in the big city like in Kashmir it was mm. it was very difficult so we just I just I remember sitting up there on the mountain just like thinking all right I'm probably not gonna make it to my show but you know I'm not gonna leave my friend here to die because that's that'd be bad no I was like I guess I'll just but you stuck it out, you made it, you got yeah. into the TV show, and then you probably, you know, let a few people die on the TV show. <laughs> yeah. uh, as I've seen in the yeah. previews, the, you know, kill your neighbor and you get to go yeah. free. Yeah, so, so, um, so that was, yeah, that was a crazy experience. Alright, so we definitely want to check out Persons Unknown on NBC June 7 to see uh, Kate and what she gets up to in that. Yeah. Fantastic. Alright, we're going to play a little game of celebrities now, Ooh. since we've been name dropping Yay. a lot of celebrities. <laughs> we're going to play our, uh, our game of celebrities. We've each put uh, 10 celebrities in the hat, and we're going to read them out and try and guess them in 45 seconds. Oh, so I'm going first? Carlos is okay. going to go first. Let's... Uh, I'm a See, little competitive, I should well, say. Well, right, okay. this. You know, I have a bit of a competitive Last time we played this, our guest won as well, so let's see okay, how yeah. we go. For 45 seconds, Carls, for celebrities, let's all squish it together. And. Okay. We're all friends. Here we go. Okay, this um, person has a sister who's a singer. She had a show on Ashley MTV. Yes. Oh, 
Um, <laughs> on the show Glee, used to be on Broadway, Spring Lee Awakening. <laughs> Gossip Girl, he's English, but he doesn't talk uh, with an English Chuck. accent. Ed, Ed, Ed West, Ed Westwick, Westwick, <laughs> Westwick, <laughs> Westwick. That was a tie. That was Used to be on Friends, now he's on Cougar Town. Yes. Oh, you are oh, good. Used to be on Dawson's Creek, now he's on Fringe. Joshua Jackson. Um, um, has her own talk show. Lovely lady who did Precious. Um, uh, 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 Oprah. <laughs> 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 Is it Oprah? Um, hey. <laughs> Is on a show that one of us sitting here is on, used to be on Ferris Bueller's Day Off. Alan Ruck! <laughs> it's a little tie. Um, American, we get points? Yeah, American we get Idol, points. Evil um, Judge. American Simon Idol. Cowell yeah. and Time. Oh, yeah. No. <laughs> I gave us each points for the tie. Okay. So, well, you're still beating me. Yes. That so it's six difficult. and four. Carly will get a total of ten for that. Oh, All right. Kate, you ready okay. to go? Yes. Let's begin. Uh, star of Community and the Soup. Joel McHale. Star of Thirty Rock. Ten Fay. Oh. Uh, another Aussie actress um, married to a country singer, I think. Oh, oh Nicole Kidman. Nicole Kidman. <laughs> Star of Lost. Magic Fox. <laughs> Star of Twilight. Robert Patterson. Um, uh, another one. Oh, girl. The other guy. Oh, uh, 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 today, Chris Stewart. Stewart. <laughs> um, other star of Thirty Rock. Man. Alec Baldwin. Oh, damn. Very rich man does that Apprentice show. Donald Trump. Trump. That was. Oh, I'll give it to you, Carly. <laughs> Uh, another star of Twilight, another female star. Oh my god! Oh, um, what's her face? Dakota Fanning? The Twilight? <laughs> she's in Twilight. She's in the second Twilight. one. She's oh, in the yeah, second she one. She's in all Bruce of them. Dallas Howard? She's one of those, uh, one of the ones that's a family Ashley member. Green? Yes. Okay. Um, uh, star of Lost. Matthew Fox. Oh, We both okay. wrote him down. What is going on with this? We're all uh, like-minded. Last one. Oh, uh, oh, star, well, we already have this, but star of 30 Rock, female, again. Tina Fey. There you go. Alright. That's, <laughs> what, happens when we, that's what happens when we all write them down, we're all thinking along the same lines. I'm not trying to think current, is that okay? Alright, ten, alright, that was ten each. Okay. Alright, this is for the, the decider. Here we go. Star of ER became Batman, Big Superman. George Clooney. Yes. Damn. Uh, star of Curb Your Enthusiasm. Larry David. Yes. Uh, star of Two and a Half Men. Charlie Sheen. <laughs> oh, you're good, Kate. Damn. Um, uh, host a show uh, with the uh, on the like CNBC Rachel lesbian. Madden. There you go. Oh, that's uh, right. <laughs> <laughs> um, star of House, English guy. Um, oh, oh, House? Hugh Laurie. Hugh Laurie. Uh, black guy from Thirty Rock, comedian. Like Tracy Morgan. Top off. Yes. Um, he to take his time. He does. Uh, the TV show after John Colbert. I can John, see it. John, Stephen John Stewart. Colbert. Oh, Stephen yeah, Colbert. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, All right. <laughs> okay. Took back the Tonight Show. Conan O'Brien. No, took it back. Oh, oh Jen Leno. Yes. yes. Uh, uh, Gilmore Girls, star of Gilmore Girls. Uh, which oh, which one? The, Lauren the Graham? Lauren Graham, correct. Okay. Uh, and, oh, we're out of time, and it's Jerry Seinfeld. Oh, oh my god, when you look at this, we're all perfect. We all got 10. Oh, we all got the exact same scores. Do we all so, get a prize? I want a prize. Yes, we, we're all winners. We're all winners. Yay! Yes. <laughs> but I totally would have gotten Jerry Seinfeld. So. This is true, but I think oh, we're yeah. a total awesome team, all of us. All right. Well, that was a lot of fun. Uh, next week on TV, it well, you know, tomorrow is the season finale of Lost. Uh, Twenty four and Chuck are both finishing. Uh, Mayim Balik Blossom pops in on Big Bang Theory to pair a possible love interest for Sheldon. They set him up on a day. The final ever Law and Order is on Monday, so that's something worth watching. Uh, plus, next week is the final TV Talk Tonight uh, for the season oh, because we're taking a break. So we're definitely going to catch us here at TV Talk Tonight Kate, we're going to see you on uh, Persons Unknown. Yep, June seventh. Uh, June seventh. June first. Wipeout is coming back to ABC and who's on, that? Who's on Wipeout? Oh. I'm on oh Wipeout. My God. So that's wow, something what a star. To watch. Uh, <laughs> we'll talk more about that next week. But thanks everyone and we'll uh, enjoy your TV viewing this week guys and we'll see you next week. Thank you.